Now listen to me, Bob. I'm putting my hand on the table, like this, okay? And I want you to touch it. Not like it's obvious, just touch my hand a little bit. You wanna touch hands? Yeah, yours and mine. All this corona doesn't bother me, it's a fuck up. My hands are clean, man. I just want some human contact. You might have washed them, but that doesn't protect me. I'm not symptomatic. Really? I had some diarrhea last week, that was it. So if I touch you and my granny catches it, what happens next, huh? And she'll die. Right. And I do not want that. I love my granny. I know, I love her too. Hmm. So I think it will be sensible if we, you know, don't touch each other till after this self-isolation. That's what I think. But you still like me, though, Bob. Of course I do. What the fuck you talking about? What is that? I love the way you chase me. Yeah. Do you remember our first time? You had me at go fuck yourself. Oh, man, I forgot about that. Uh, you know, I was such an asshole. I saw you with that dumb fucking look on your face like you've tried in some dog shit, like you're doing now. And I thought, well, maybe he's not marriage material. But I decided to put all my time into catching him because, you know, I'm in love with you. That's a beautiful thing. You know, I didn't realize you were feeling the same things about me as I was feeling about you. And that means a lot to me, you know. Maybe if I had known that, things would have been different. Maybe I would have married you. Hmm. Now he tells me. So what are you going to do about it? After lockdown? Yeah, what happens after that? We can touch each other again. I'll move in, we'll cook together, I'll pay my way, we'll do some horse riding, it'll be fun. So, before that, I'm gonna have to tell you. Hmm? Just remember I love you, you fucking asshole. I love you too, man. <laughs>